everybody, this is DrunkGoomba1645, welcome back to more Let's Play Lost Odyssey. Yeah, sorry for that brief little pause. Reason, I just don't know, I just felt like doing that. And, one little thing I want to show off right now. Oh, freaking hell yeah, guitar solo biatch. Okay, that took a little longer than it needed to be, but who cares? That guitar solo, solo is so kick-ass. Anyways, let's proceed forward to the refugee camp in the west entrance. Oh, it's warm over there. Over here. Why are there so many people? This must be the place where the refugees from Goza went after it froze over. That must mean that it's safe here. Finally, I can take a load off in peace. And I still cannot speak proper English. Why? I don't know. Anyways, we have now reached the Goza refugee camp. If For those who are completely unaware, yeah, refugee camp... Uh, to tell the truth, I don't really know where they are, what they are, but uh, I do know that uh, involves uh, yeah, involves lots of people gathering in a single area after a major event. Okay, anyways, we can now make level two rigs. So yay, thank God for that. And now, before I begin, time for some shopping. Oh dear, what's up? You got custom? You got customers now? Don't look so down in the dumps. No, it's just, well, monsters have started to appear around camp, and these ones are unusually well organized. Several people have been injured already trying to run away from them, and some have been killed while looking for food and medicine. It's a troubling situation. I know, you guys look strong enough. Can I ask you a favor? The Gyalops that appears along the trail have a habit of crying out help for help to their legions of friends whenever they're in trouble. If you let them cry out often enough, you'll attract the attention of their leader, Don Laplos. Beating him will surely sell all the others down. <coughs> Excuse me. Could you kill Don Laplos, Laplos and bring us the clause's proof? You will be amply rewarded for doing us this great favor. So, yeah, that pretty much opens up a little side quest for us. And of course I will be doing it because the reward is actually pretty damn good. But first, shopping! That'll work. Okay, I'm finally finished with my shopping. We got all we all gotta stick together at times like these. See you around. And it's time to equip my new things. Yay! I love doing this sort of thing. Hmm. <sighs> okay, that wasn't too bad. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh man, sorry about that. Again, I must have some snot or something in the back of my throat. I don't know. It's it's weird. But, whatever. The reason why I bought the Rough Edge now is because... Hopefully, we'll find someone who can actually use these weapons. 
So, anyways... In order to trigger this side quest, head back outside and head back to the Frozen Trail. This is where you can begin this little side quest. The reason why I am doing this side quest, I think I explained this already, but... Yeah, the reward is actually well worth it in the end. Seriously, if you have, have the time and have the you know, the resources and everything that you need, um, by all means, do this. Just uh, stick around this area, stick around near the staircase, so when you do actually fight and defeat this thing, you know, you'll be, uh, you'll be fine. Hey, Kime, Kime didn't go that way. Let's go down off the tracks and search for him. So, yeah, I guess I was able to successfully show that off. And speaking of which, looks like the cavalry has arrived. Let's hope it's the right enemy. Oh yeah! Excellent! So, my strategy when taking on these evil dinosaurs or Gylops, leave one alive and just uh, eliminate the rest. Let's see, they are wind type. Well, that's their element in the their beast, obviously, so I guess ground will work, so. Hey! Ground up, or this guy! Cook, you defend, back, you kill this guy. What am I to talk about today? Um, well, as of late, I haven't exactly been using, like, a color corrector of any sort. However, this time, I'm going to try to use color corrector again. The reason I haven't been using a color corrector of any sort is just, uh, just simply because I haven't I just have it. So yeah, that's the basic strategy here. Just uh, wait for enemy reinforcements to come as you leave one alive, and hopefully the leader will show up eventually. Alright, Coke, what can I have you do since, uh, let's see, is it chill? One thing that is kind of bothersome during this, uh, segment of the side quest... Well, Mac will have a bit of a tendency to actually counterattack. This can be problematic when it comes to leaving one enemy alive. But, still, just be patient and the leader will eventually appear. Let's use Cure All again. Let's use Little Jansen. Chill, I am not exactly sure what that does. I think that's like, uh, kind of like paralysis. Well, no, not like paralysis. It's kind of like, uh. I'm thinking it's kind of like the, you know. I think my mom's outside my door. That's just perfect. Yes! Okay, why is that? Alright. Okay. Sorry about that. My mother just wanted to talk to me after I finished my recording session. And also, we can now actually, well, we can now actually take on the leader because the leader has finally arrived. So let's use all ground and wipe these guys out once and for all. You use cure all and Bing and Mac go and attack and kill this thing. Damn, that's a massive damage. But whatever. At least it worked out in the end. Because I know Cook is going to heal Mac their cure all ability. Wow, that guy just keeps calling him reinforcements over and over again. And also I cured Ming. So, yeah, sorry for the mistake. That was my fault. But it's okay. Everything's fine now. 
cure all on Mac because he needs it desperately. And let's begin again. Damn, mate. Yeah. Seriously. Okay, that wasn't too good. The reason was because the. Of course, because the counterattack glitch with the allies' turn begins. Crap. You pretty much get it. You've seen it in the uh, experimental staff facility. Yeah, that's just what happened there. Oh, man. Thing is taking forever. Alright, Cook. It's time for some healing. Use Healer on that, because he needs it badly. And let's begin again. Say something? Now I can't remember what. And damn it, more allies are being called into battle. Damn it, come on, leave Mac alone! Well, there's another one down, thank freaking Lord. And thank God Cook actually healed Mac. Of course he's gonna be poisoned again. That's a bitch. But whatever. Your poison on Mac, Mac, you attack again. Let's go. Also, maybe I kind of wanted to mention, I am going to try to make these videos a little bit shorter than they normally are. The reason is because as of late, I've noticed that the, you know, I haven't ha had to, not very many people watch the videos that are like 25 minutes or 28 minutes or whatever. Whatever. Side quest done. So, yeah. If a uh, video seems to be like, uh, I don't know, say 13 minutes, 15 minutes, or even 18 minutes, I don't really care about the length anymore. Just, uh, yeah. I've noticed that the attention span upon uh, YouTube users just, uh, you know, they're not exactly interested in watching like a 30 minute marathon of me doing something and just talking about crap. Forgive me. Yeah, forgive me, really? It's a monster. Idiot. Okay, let's proceed back to the camp now because I'm tired of this. Well, no, I'm not tired of uh, the quest because it's already done. I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm just pretty tired right now. I'm annoyed. That's the end of it. Okay, back at the camp again. Since the side quest is done, return to the shop and talk to the shop person right here. Ah, uh, it's you. Say, is that the claws of Don Laplos? Oh, thank you. I'm thoroughly impressed that you... Okay, that is right. I'm thoroughly impressed that you actually defeated him. You saved the lives of all the refugees here. Thank you so much. Here's the reward that we promised. Ooh, a s sacred torch and a sacred ring. So, yeah. That's pretty much a... I think that's Cook's staff that we can earn. Yeah, it is. It only increases her attack, her stats by three. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll take that. And it's more money for me anyway, because I can sell off her staff, which I bought earlier. So, get rid of this. Keep my rough edges, because I need someone who can use them. And we will be encountering them sometime soon. By them, uh, you'll just have to wait and see who I'm referring to. Well, stats are completely healed because I entered a refugee camp on the world map, so <laughs> of course. Let's save and let's continue. <sighs> Getting back to the discussion about the color corrector thing. I originally used color corrector before to, well, make the videos look nicer and brighter. Ooh, 1,000 gold in a pot, that's nice. So, yeah, after a little bit of time trying to use it, I thought it did nothing after a little while, 
and it turns out I actually did something wrong throughout some parts when I tried to use color corrector. And this is coming from my, my video editing software, Sony Vegas Pro 9, to be exact. And, yeah, that's basically what's going on. I was actually using the wrong color corrector thing. You know how uh, you would use, like, something like, uh, you know, Studio RGB to Computer RGB or something like that? I was using the opposite, and therefore it did nothing. So, <laughs> that's why some videos looked a little bit more blurry than usual. But still, they look fine the way they are, but right now I'm going to try... Oh, I found a lemur. Excellent. Or a pip. It's called a pip, by the way. Ooh, took something out of the pot. Earth charm. And that's it. Okay, it's a pip pot. <sighs> that's the name of it. A pip pot. So, <laughs> let's see. We got a nah. tank. Uh, I'll give it a healing tank. In a bottle, not enough items. If you happen to give the uh, Pipot uh, certain items and you don't have enough of a particular item, it returns all items that uh, you previously had had given to it. No. And usually, if you don't give it anything, or it just, or you just don't have enough, it'll just say it looks regretful. So yeah, that's. The a little bit of information about the pipot thing. Again, it looks like a freaking lemur, but it isn't. <coughs> Excuse me again. Hmm. What am I to talk about now? I had something in mind, but now I forgot. Again, dang it. Huh. Dang. What is it I wanted to talk about? I'm pretty sure there is a purpose to this area here. I just can't find it at the moment. Maybe I have to trigger something and have something happen here in order to trigger another set event. I'm not sure. That's pretty weird. Oh, by the way, I I think I remember one thing I wanted to talk about, but I'll hold that off for a minute because we got a cutscene. It probably got attacked by them as ice creatures. Did you hear that? Just now? I wonder. It must be. It must be what? Huh? What do you two want? Where's the train that you were talking about? Huh? Train? Please tell us. Uh. Um. Okay. Um... Please? Um... Uh... That away. Thank you. Train? Yeah. I think it's worth a look. Hey! It's dangerous up there. There was some really weird stuff going on. You know, 